health worker Zarifa Hasanova sees patients in an old barn. It has no waiting room, no heat, water or privacy. The village library is right across the aisle. Zarifa sees people from neighboring villages too, upwards of 20 a day, with a meager supply of medicines and basic equipment. I come a lot because I have bad kidneys and high blood pressure. The closest hospital is far away over bad roads and expensive. But steps away is a new clinic, funded in part by the World Bank. In a few weeks, patients will be treated in three gleaming examination rooms with running water. It will be a lot more comfortable for patients. The village is very excited. Hundreds of small Azeri communities have applied for and received grants to build or fix their rural infrastructure. Some villages update their clinic. Others build a new school. Many opt for a new road. Not an expensive paved road, but a plain gravel one for doctors and teachers to get in, villagers to get out, produce to reach market. Taxi drivers once charged extra to travel the old road from Lac Village to the closest market because deep ruts damaged their cars. Now it costs this farmer four minat, half the old price. And it's a lot faster now too. It takes 20 minutes instead of 40. In applying for grants, villagers decide what's important to them. They chip in with cash and labor. Thinking together and pulling together builds communities. This map makes sure the road is fixed past the houses of those who lost family members in the war, widows and Afghan veterans. Most of the farmers in this village make money selling strawberries. They bought a new generator and fixed power lines that fuel their irrigation system. Because they now have reliable water for their crops, many plant larger areas. Sultan Akbarov's patch is three times what it was. His wife wants to use any extra profits they will make to buy livestock to have milk for her two boys. Sultan wants to put them into the house in which he was born. <laughs> With my gains, I will fix up my house for my family. Half a million Azeri villagers improved their lives and made their villages better places to live through this project, which is set to expand next year.